Hi guys, welcome to the first look at the new upcoming construction simulator game, Roadcraft, from Saber Interactive, the makers of Mudrunner and Snowrunner series. So let's roll the trailer and have a look. When I was a kid, I couldn't wait to leave this town behind. But what's that saying? Man plans and God laughs? Uh, he must have had a good one on my account. When the water receded, it carried away everything we ever had. It also gave me a reason to stay. Truth is, we can't stop what's coming. The important thing is that we rebuild. Well, I don't know about you guys, but that looks pretty cool. Let me know in the comments what you think. Now, the description we've got on this at the moment, it says you run a disaster recovery company specializing in restoring sites devastated by natural disasters. Many tasks await you to restart the local industry, clearing debris, replacing faulty equipment, rebuilding roads and bridges damaged by the weather and much more. With your vehicles, choose carefully your itinerary through the, their abandoned factories, submerged dams, and out-of-service solar fields. As an operations manager, guide your transport trucks by plotting the routes on the map and ensure no obstacles block your way. Experience a new generation of advanced simulation developed by Sabre Interactive, the creators of Mudrunner Snowrunner. Now, it also says rebuild de devastated areas alone and in co-op. So co-op is coming, and I'm sure they're going to have mods with this. It's going to be more or less the same as what we get with SnowRunner. You wait and see. It's set telling us we're going to have over 40 vehicles from bulldozers to construction cranes intervene in various regions around the world with eight maps, each uh, four kilometers square in size. Which, if you want to know, that's the if you're on SnowRunner, that's the size of Smithville Dam. And then we manipulate elements like wood, wood, sand, asphalt, powered by Sabre's Interactive's new physics engine. Construct new roads and bridges to ease the travel through the region. Plot point-to-point -point routes on your map to guide the logistics convoys and recycle every piece of debris into the re reconstruction material. So, now that... It's got my interest. It really has. It's always nice to have something new. I was getting a little bit bored of Snow Runner where it was all the same. So it looks like we're going to be able to fix your roads and bridges instead of just pushing a button to do that, which I think will be awesome. And especially with a four player, then you can't beat that. Now, I've managed to dig out some more screenshots, so I'll leave them with a little music montage. Thanks for watching. As soon as I know a bit more on Roadcraft, I will let you know.